Hello, everybody. I'm Peter Cook, and I teach science here at Wake. Now, what I want to do is to show you some of the really interesting experiments that we do for children. Now, here, I've got an old computer screen. And here, we've got a picture of the Northern Lights. What I'm going to show you today is that the colors here and the colors on the screen here are made in exactly the same way. Now, before we start, I don't want you to try this at home. The voltages in here are more than enough to kill you. Mm. Now, let's put the lights out, then we can see. I put the lights out here. You can see on the screen a little light. Now, that little light is a beam of electrons being shot at the screen, and when they hit the screen, they fluoresce, they make light. Now, the way that these old computer screens work is that you can move that little dot of light using electromagnets. And on the back of the screen, I've put some switches so you can see just that. Now, let's see what happens when I switch one and two on. Now, you can see a line. That's because the electromagnets at the top and the bottom are moving the beam of electrons up and down. Now I can change that line and I can switch these two magnets off and these two on. So let's try that. Two, three. And now you can see the line goes across this way. Now something very interesting, especially for the children, is to see the line move. Because this beam is made by electrons, I can move it around using a very powerful magnet that will attract and repel. Now let's see. Here's my big magnet, and if I bring it towards the screen, do you see? It bends this way, attracts the electrons, mm -hmm. and if I turn the magnet around, it repels, and I can move that along the line, and you can see the colors, the same colors you see with the northern lights. Now, let's put all these magnets back on, and there's my picture. Now, it looks a bit strange because of the camera. Now let's switch the lights back on and look at the picture over here. Now these colours are made when the sun throws particles at the earth really fast and they hit the earth's magnetic field and the air fluoresces. It makes light in exactly the same way as my TV screen. Well. That's all for this week. We'll see you next week when we'll have some really interesting experiments. See you soon. Bye-bye.